Hi, um, welcome to this series of videos. In this video in particular, we're going to go through a basic overview of Moodle. Moodle is a learning management system developed in Australia. It's an open source software and it allows us to teach a course how we want to teach it. Uh, it's modular, it has blocks that you can um, modify however you want to, and um, there are very few limitations. It allows you to integrate many functions, but one of the goals a learning management system has is to keep the learner within the system to be able to administer the whole learning process so you don't have to receive emails inside the system. For example, you don't have to go to a different forum. You don't have to use a wiki elsewhere. You don't have to link to millions of resources, but none of them are within the site. While you can still link to resources anywhere, um, you can also add many resources within the site. So how do we do this? Well. When you access your course site, you'll be you'll see uh, many, many blocks, and you usually have two frames uh, to the sides apart from the middle frame. And in those frames, you'll have different blocks. Uh, all these blocks you can move out of the way if you want to. So uh, let's highlight here. You have a minus sign that allows you to collapse that block. So let's collapse them all. So go ahead and collapse your blocks. Let's extend them again. Good. So by now you have collapsed the blocks that are around your screen and you have extended them again. Now the next thing we're going to do is make those blocks move away or disappear from the screen um, into the margins. So you have a little arrow by the blocks. Press the arrow and you'll start seeing them accumulate to the side of the screen. If you do that, all of a sudden your course site goes from having three frames basically to having one frame and tabs on the side of the screen. Okay, so that's how you put them on the side of the screen. But I actually like them to be in the screen, I got used to it. So in my favorite Moodle view, I actually do have three frames. So I'm going to reintegrate or re-add those different elements by clicking the arrow now instead of going away, an arrow that tells you to bring it back in. So you can see the little arrow. Let me stop for a second. That's the little arrow. So it says undock this item. A lot of times if you hover, if you stay on top of the icon for a little bit, like many other web applications, it'll tell you what it does. So hover a little bit sometimes and wait for it to tell you what it does. And there's a lot of icons. We're actually about to go over a lot of more icons. So um, Again, don't be terrified by the icons, just hover over them and they'll tell you what to do most of the time. Uh, so now it comes the next part is how you edit your site, how you modify things, how you add more blocks. So we had some default blocks, we'll add more blocks now. And the next thing is we'll also be able to add things inside the blocks. So they say topic one to topic 16 right now, but that's not what we want. We actually want them to contain documents, assignments. How do we do that? Uh, I'm gonna show you that in the next video, thanks.